This is the moment the chain snap directly on this turn, putting me on a head-on collision course with the tree. Out of all the space on the property, it could have snapped anywhere and I would have been fine, but it, I, there was nothing I could do. I couldn't steer it anyway. I just sat there and braced for the impact. As you can see, I hit that tree pretty hard. And I'm gonna let you guys hear the regular speed. There was nothing I could do. I started to jump off since I was able to, not able to turn it, but it happened at a split second. But it sucked. I just knew I ruined the whole front end of the, of the uh, six by six, guys. I was extremely upset. I was upset that I crashed. And, but it was, turned out to be not that bad you guys will see let me put it in regular motion regular speed Guys, the chain just broke on me and wears under those sprockets, and I couldn't stop. I couldn't do nothing in that crash. I couldn't turn or nothing. It wears and jammed that side up, and out of all the space in the world, it ran me dead to this tree. It ran me head smack onto this tree. That was a nice little impact. I needed an airbag in there. Got some damage. It ain't bad. Not as bad as I thought it could be. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That's all right. We're gonna fix it. Could have been worse, man. I hit. Ain't gonna stop it from floating. That was a hard hit, guys. The chain locked up under this sprocket. Hey, the chain locked up on this sprocket and it wedged and locked this whole wheel up over this whole side. And it, it will do it at this point right here. I should replace that last messed up chain. Oh man. Okay guys, let's look at the damage again. You can see it cracked right there. And we're gonna get some fiberglass and fix it from, from both sides. From both sides. Everything else is fine, so it hit right there. Kind of that. Could have been worse. It's been there. So it dented in there. Bent the trim in. I mean, that's in pretty good. Got a slight be in there. I'm gonna sand this down, put some more fiberglass there. And we still, still be good on the water. We still be good on water still. And um, how hard I hit, guys. Lucky this was kind of shaped off. Man, this took the, a hard impact. And could have been a whole lot worse. I was expecting way worse than this. But if I want to fix this, it won't be bad at all. It won't be bad at all. Just bend this trim out. But I was expecting a whole lot worse. So another thing, a couple things going on. Know. I should have had my helmet on for one. I just wanted to go for a test drive real quick, but real quick could have been something serious if I had hurt myself. So I should have had a helmet on. And a couple of things. And another thing I want to address is the brakes. I got to fix these brakes. They're too tight. So they're barely stopping and the throttle cable is off. It's open three quarter throttle. It's not open four throttle. I still got a whole lot of throttle left in here to open it all the way up. Look at that. So, three quarter throttle. Got to adjust that out some more. This was like this when I got it, so I kind of went back with this setup because I don't know if they had the wrong cable or what, but it wasn't working right for this. So, luckily I was only able to go three quarter inch throttle. Uh, probably could have been way worse. And everything else is okay. So replacing that chain, 
getting the, that chain out of here too. Just gonna replace them all. You got time for going through all this, breaking chains. We're not doing this. Cause that chain breaks and this thing is dangerous, extremely dangerous. So, uh, things happen, man. Everything else is all good. Could have been worse. I should have had a helmet on once again. But, uh, it's running good. It's running good. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. We'll be back with this thing. So, the light, cover, the light lens came for the Honda moped. So, this is all ready to go. And we're picking up the Mustang. I'm doing a little work to the Suburban. I'm recording a video for this right now. And we, the Mustang will be here tomorrow or the next day, whenever I go get it. So clean everything out for that. Just a little set back here. But like I said, chain broke and steered me into that tree. Could have been worse. Let me show you guys the light lens for the moped. Okay, here it is right here. Got the screws, screws in, came with two new screws. So good, get a little clear light underneath it. So we're gonna screw this in. Oh, and another thing I wanna know guys that didn't help my situation out better, out of all the tires, look at this. No air. This <laughs> needs some air in it. No air in the tire, man. Everything else is okay. But, it is what it is. We're going to get it right. We've already started the process. Get some sand in. I'm going to make this look really nice. Now, this is already been fiberglassed. Fixed it up real nice. And I fixed this one up too. We're going to make this look nice too. I'll start doing this one over. I'm going to bend this trim out. I'm going to build this back up. Build this back up. This one looks nice when I'm done. Also, new chains. New chains. So we will be back up and going, and I fixed the car. It won't come off no more. Back up and going in a minute.